All right, so I know it's been a, a little bit since I've done a video, but I just had to share the unboxing of this with everyone. So I just got this big box in the middle of the day. And let's uh, discover what's inside. This little box that came in the package is Final Fantasy VII Deluxe Edition. And you can see that. Nice and big. Comes with a little uh, Tifa Aerith Cloud and Barrett lanyard. Interesting. <laughs> That's all for that little box. But still, in this bigger box. We've got a Play Arts action figure Kai. <laughs> oh. So if you haven't picked up already, this is the first class, uh, soldier first class edition of Final Fantasy VII that I got ordered in from Square Enix. You had to specifically get this from the Square Enix store, which is why it comes all in Square Enix packaging. This thing is packaged in here. Good. And you got foam on the inside to help protect it. This is surprisingly upside down though. I guess I did put the box on upside down. Oof. Let me get it out without damaging it. So nothing really on the box to note what it is. I'll open that up here in just a second. If you didn't already know about this uh, <coughs> this figure, it is well, the, like the whole thing as a whole, the game, all the DLC, all the extra stuff, and then the statue. It's three hundred and twenty bucks. If you want to know why I spent three hundred twenty bucks on a video game, it's because this is legitimately my favorite game of all time, Final Fantasy VII. So I of course had to get the best special edition version of it. Alright. Side now open it up so you can see this beautiful thing. take the camera off and let you get a closer look at that. So inside the box here we've got the Daytona I believe was the name of the bike. Yeah the Hardy Daytona is what it's called. Some big old bikes in there. And then Cloud himself. It's a pretty nice quality figure. Little, uh, figure Arts Kai. They've had a few of them from the Square Enix. They did like the Samurai Batman and stuff like that. It's pretty nice looking. Oh, and the sword's underneath. Hold on, I'm gonna lift it up so we can see the sword. So as you can see, Cloud kind of just pops out on his own little swivel there. And then underneath him is the Buster Blade. 
so freaking nice. Hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's been a little while since I've uploaded anything. But I do hope everyone enjoyed this. It was freaking gorgeous. Thanks for tuning in.